Shout out to Shad and bro. Oh, yeah. There we go. <laughs> Best fight yep. scenes in all Star Wars, really? To see the full fight scene autopsy break down Star Wars, the Acolyte episode 5 click on Shepard. Now, I, I want to see what he has to say. He didn't have a freaking heart attack watching this. Yeah, he, he looks like he's <laughs> smiling. He looks like he's smiling, but so I'm happy with this. So let's shout out to Shad. Uh, let's go ahead and check this out. <laughs> Again, not aiming for the opponent. Sol doesn't dodge nope. then. That is just Smilo missing on purpose. Uh, aiming for each other's lightsabers low. Aiming, that's standard. Oh, that, I, like, what are they aiming for at all? That's standard. That's standard <laughs> stage choreography. That's another one. <laughs> aiming for nothing as well as the opponent's <laughs> lightsabers goes down. What the fuck was Jackie that? He wasn't even yeah. in that position. <laughs> yes, <laughs> he wasn't. So, okay, I pause. Pause. Pause real quick. <laughs> okay, what she did is equivalent of a in boxing. It's called a slip. A slip is if you're getting a straight shot straight at your head, and all you do is move your head offline. Okay, it does not work against a 12 to 6 strike. If you and especially with a sword or a stick, in this case, it's a sword. If someone is swinging a sword from 12 o'clock to 6 o'clock and you slip, you're getting cut in half. Mm. That's ridiculous. If it yeah. was a thrust, it would make more sense. If he was thrusting for her face and she slipped it, that's just moving her head offline, then it would have missed her. But instead, he's doing a downward strike. And she's slipping, but her ass is still where her head was. So that means she would he would cut her ass in half if he was aiming for her ass. She's pretty hot. I'll, I'll, I'll probably pick it up and keep it. <laughs> 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 the crazy thing is that she, that this girl is uh, Daphne Keen. Um, da, and that Daphne Keen. Uh, she's uh, she, she she's uh, what's it called again? Um, right? X twenty three. Yeah. 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 All right. Let's continue. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Jesus. out of measure. Okay. <laughs> Now look at this what one. The, where did the second Double lightsaber come aiming from? for air? So she basically, um, I believe she, someone dies and then she, she grabs it. I believe. I, I, I forgot. I forgot what, what happens. I believe, uh, uh, she, oh, okay. Okay. I, okay. I remember now she, she has her own. That's green. And then, uh, I think may basically stole, um, Wookiee, Wookiee Jedi's and then yeah. she basically, uh, confiscates it. So she yeah. had two. Okay. So, yeah, had two. Yeah. You know, fighting with two sticks is actually a lot harder than fighting with one. So I yeah. Even, even back in like uh in uh, Attack of the Clones, when Obi Wan tosses Anakin his lightsaber, and Anakin now has two. I'm like, great, you just crippled him because fighting with one sword is much easier than fighting with two. Once you have two, yeah. you're all fucked up. So yep. it's I again it's a movie thing it's a movie ass movie thing that oh now i have two swords so i'm twice as deadly no you're twice as easy to kill yeah same thing with um uh guns akimboing like yeah. dual wielding guns yeah. that's stupid man like i yeah I've, I've and seen anyone so who's many... held and, and shoot a gun would know that just shooting with one one gun is already difficult let alone two like, yeah. the, the movies are bs right the, 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 another, high, another, okay, another, action it's it, that's bs man another quick like uh fight thing okay so she slips the lightsaber. Let's just say, let's just pretend for a second that, you know, the slip worked because she stepped to the side. She didn't step to the side. But had she stepped to the side with her slip, then it would have missed her, assuming he was aiming for her body. Mm. But with her body in the position he is, she is where she, her head is kind of lower to the ground and her weight's all on her front foot. At that moment, his legs are wide open. You cut it off. Instead, yep. he swings for the fucking head. You know who swings? You know who always swings for the head in sparring class? Rookies, mm -hmm. new people and inexperienced people always hunt for the head. They and never say, aim for other body parts. This so goes. <laughs> this goes the same for, uh, for 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 shooting sports. Um, so 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 whenever I go train and stuff like that, um, and w w when I learned from my uh, my brother in law, um. He basically says uh, you want to go for center mass. It's because it's easier. It's, it's you're easier to shoot. Like especially if you're going yeah. like, like like let's say a, a person's about like 25 yards away or something like that. You're if, if, if you're going for the head, that, that, the chances of you missing is a lot higher, right? And that's what that's why when Joe Biden said, shoot him in the leg, right? Just shoot him in the leg. It's like no, no, dude. It's like yeah. if, if you're trying to like maim them, you might hit the actual um the actual artery that will actually kill them, that make 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 them bleed out. So you don't want that. So center mass is usually the way to go. And that's the reason why uh, w when cops, when you see a lot of these like police, uh, you know, body cams and stuff like that, like they all go for center mass is because it's easier and it's better. Like, it, like you're always going to go for the easiest route. And same thing with like knife fighting or something like that, right? You always want to go for center mass, right? The fact that the, the head is so small, the neck is so small, especially 
if there's if they're standing there and you're already missing trying to shoot center mass imagine if they're moving yep yep right so uh but yeah let, 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 Keep let's going. continue this these is are great comments in the chats, by the way i don't know <laughs> what he was aiming at again not even anywhere <laughs> near again. oh my gosh and this is i think what the main thing that people are like going oh this is so cool you look at it they're not even aiming for each other Okay, that's actually not bad. He's He has to dodge. See what I mean? When it's in measure, it looks better. That's the type of stuff we need. All right, Soul comes down for a hit. Literally, like... Okay, that's a good one. You know it's missing because it passes in front of Smilo right here. And... It's <laughs> actually really bad. Oh, So Smilo is here. His guard is so, so low that a hit coming in would just hit him in the head. Okay? Mm -hmm. Like, he's not trying to guard his head. He's like, yeah. And so yeah. aims for the lightsaber. And if he was just a little bit closer in, would have sliced his head. Smile his head. Yeah, yeah, but he's got that stupid helmet on. So, you know. Yeah. Sorry, and and, and so, someone mentioned in the chat, it's like, uh, what's it called again? Uh, who who mentioned it right over here? Uh, yeah, his speech HD. I think this lightsaber choreography should be labeled as interpretive. <laughs> oh, it, it's the power of many lightsaber school. <laughs> <laughs> See, okay, okay, so so here's the thing. Um, if you guys don't know, um, uh, what's it called again? Whenever you're fighting, a lot of these skills are diminish. These skills can diminish. So if you guys don't practice, if you guys are complacent, mm -hmm. like like yep. shooting sports, uh, martial arts, uh, and, yep. and and even uh, in, in sword fighting. It's all diminishing. So like you have to practice all the time. It's not like your bike. Mm -hmm. Oh, I remember how to ride a bike, right? Yep. For instance, um, the thing is that, like, let's say the reason why he sucks, okay? I, I'm, I'm playing devil, devil's advocate here. Let's say the reason why he sucks is because the Jedi has been so complacent because they haven't seen a Sith. They don't even, this guy doesn't even know what a Sith is, right? It's Stupid, yeah. But yeah, so they haven't, they haven't had any trouble in such a long time. They forgot how to fight, right? But the thing is, in my opinion, and I believe Star Wars girls mentioned this uh, when we were on Versus. Where the fuck was Yoda? Exactly. He's supposed to be. He's supposed to be years here. Old. He was here. They never explained oh. it. Do you know why? It's because a bald green girl that's uh that that does Leslie. Yeah, Hedges, we, uh, wife we, is we, we have. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. We haven't we haven't even gotten to the light whip part of this. this team. Yeah, the light There's whip. Haven't. I think she's. I'm pretty sure it's her who's wielding it. It's the green. It's green bald girl who's gonna wield that whip. Yeah, so, man. Looking forward to that. Let's see how that turns out. <laughs> yeah, but before we move forward, yo, Mo Zamboni with the two dollars super chat. It says R E D S W Mifune. Aren't you tired of being stupid? <laughs> yo, thank you, thank you so much for that, man. And another follow up to uh, two dollars super chat in competition. To, uh, competition. The waist is the tell. Yeah, R E movement. Yeah, yeah. The movement here. It's like the line is off, right? Like. Like the, the the he's sort of like offline over here, and same thing with it. But yeah, this is all just dancing, man. This is this is this is really really bad. Uh, but yeah. Um, let's uh let's continue to see what he has to say. Right in two, but it's purposely this. This is <laughs> look at that overswing, like a oh, he's completely open and soul had any so smile should be dead right here yeah i would have seen him that yes. is, is horrible yeah. instead he poses and soul is moving back instead of taking oh. like smile yeah. is literally presenting his whole unguarded body to soul and so like <laughs> you know instead of de de defeating his evil villain i'm going to literally withdraw <laughs> Yeah. A Jedi doesn't attack the back. That's why. Oh, is that what supposed wait, to attack up. the back? It's like, wait, his back is turned. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, no, 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 not allowed, not allowed. Right, not turn, allowed. Around, turn, around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> you know what? You can still cut his arm off at this point. Yep. Do, do you know what? You, do you know what you call that? Called disarming your enemies. <laughs> <laughs> I'll stop. I'll stop. I'll stop chat. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, Ogami did not find that funny. He's like, this is I, I he's like, I'm never gonna be coming back onto the show ever again. <laughs> no, I, I I just put in the private chat, I'm going to look up one of the classic Hong Kong Yeah, sword yeah, go ahead, man. Yeah, go, go, yeah, go for it. No, I'll play it in a minute, but when we're done yeah. to cleanse our palate, we're gonna show you what actual and this is not realistic sword fighting at all. This is like Hong Kong style. They're using the force of chi. They're flying through the air. You could easily see them replacing their swords with lightsabers, and it would be heads and shoulders above everything. And this was like forty years ago or fifty yeah. years ago, probably. So we'll watch that afterwards. But let's go finish this 
fucking travesty. Yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, uh, be, 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 before we finish oh. it, let's see. Uh, Joe C eight one eight Pure Blood. Thank you so much for the gifted membership, man. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you. All right, let's, uh, let's, let's, let's go on him. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> he, yeah, the fact that he backs up this thing is fine. Scene is good. Come off it. Instead of actually hitting him, Jackie or whatever her name is with a lightsaber right here decides to swing it behind herself. Look what she does here. And look, Smiler is completely open <laughs> on his side. She could have killed it. This is what I mean. As no soon reason. as you now have more than two people, they don't know what to do with this choreography. Because they got like it. Spin, 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 spin. Yeah, like freaking like a uh, carnival, like freaking river dance music. No, you, you got to replace it with fucking like house trance music or like Skrillex, and that would work. <laughs> yeah, like freaking. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. <laughs> oh man, dude! And now Smile is open to Soul. Soul doesn't take advantage of it at all. Jackie blocks. Yep. Soul decides to come down <laughs> and kick him. Yeah, why not hit him? Chop <laughs> his arm. Smiler's weapon is now engaged and taken out of the picture because he's blocking Jackie's downways attack. So Soul, instead of stabbing him, because like, you're like, right here, right here. He's dead. Work. Soul Sorry. decides to kick him. Even though he it's like, why, dude? It's yeah, it's yeah. I, I think if they were trained, they were actually using swords instead. Yeah, they could be like, whoa, I don't want to get hit by that. You know, like, oh, it's like, holy crap, man. Like, now, now here's the thing. We saw um, in, in Game of Thrones, uh, there was a flashback scene with Sir whoever. I think it was a young Ned Stark that's played. Uh, that, uh, in the flashback scene, there was a scene where he was dual wielding the swords. Right? Yep. And I believe there was sort of, it was probably not, it's not even nowhere. It, it, that 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 was sort of bad, but it's nowhere near this bad. No. Oh man, space rave battle. <laughs> space now let me just rave. let me just say one thing about like uh, one of the common criticisms of a lot of these choreographies, especially when you start slowing it down, is that some of the standard hits, it like they're clashing lightsabers and not really aiming for them for each other. It's because you, when you slow it down, it looks really bad. But that's kind of standard stage fight choreography. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, you're supposed to follow it up with something that looks like they're trying to actually kill each other. Yeah. Like, uh, if you watch the duel of the chatty duelist from Princess Bride, someone actually did replace their rapiers with lightsabers. And it's fantastic, because even though they're still doing a lot of like, flashy sword play, they're still trying to win the duel. Yeah. You know, they're still trying to win. They're trying to actually stab each other, trying to actually slash each other. So... Again, because they choreograph it using actual swords, they don't really get the cool light effect of spinning crappy bullshit. Then they have to kind of actually look, make at least make you believe they're trying to actually hit each other. With this yeah. stuff, they're not, and it's really pathetic. But what I was bringing up was that sometimes people will stop and look. Here they are, just clashing lightsabers, like high, low, high, low. Okay, that's something that is done so commonly in everything that it's like that's standard. Mm -hmm. But again. That's I don't really buy I don't really I don't really see that as a valid criticism because that's all fight choreography. But when you have these close ups and these quick cuts and these angles, that's when you're supposed to see something significant. That's supposed to be something you that you don't see from far away. That's supposed to be a significant strike. Again, the language of violence. Yeah. Have it. The, when someone goes high, you go low. When someone goes low, you go high. This is even in a one on one fight, I do Muay Thai. Muay Thai is eight eight limbs you have both hand both fists both elbows both knees and both shins you punch high you kick low you kick low you elbow high you don't just keep hammering someone up high and put their hands up and not hit them in the body and not kick their leg <laughs> and then yeah. so the fact that you have two of them now one of them goes high the other one just cuts his leg off there you don't have to kill him you you yeah. take his leg out and now he's done it's because i'm pretty sure they want to interrogate him Right, so yeah, yeah, just 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 cut off his legs, and just 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 grab him. But yeah, but then, the, the, yeah. Anyway, keep going. Yeah, let's continue. Yeah, like, oh, this is so stupid. Oh, I like this is as bad as the last Jedi throne room scene. That move right there. He could have like just run him through, but I'm just gonna decide to kick this 
horrible, evil assassin <laughs> Sith that wants to kill everyone murdered for Jedi already. I'll just kick him instead, instead of, you know. Yeah, it would have been better to sweep away. Soul comes in, yeah. grabs yeah. him this time. Oh, Another come off game. it! Saul is literally holding Smilo's lightsaber at bay. He's like, all right, free Have shot, him. open, kill him, kill him, Padawan. And she comes in and kicks him. Kick. Your lightsaber's right there. You can kill him, but instead you're going to kick him because you're a <laughs> retard. Come off it. I can't stand this crap. Oh, my gosh. Do you see, like, how are we supposed to be invested in this fight when you have dumb crap like that happening? <laughs> see what he does here? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I, I, I like what he's, he's getting mad. He's getting angry, man. Obviously, he's wearing the clitoris. I'm a clitoris. Clitoris. Yeah. pants. Yeah, I, I was gonna. I thought I thought they were clitoris pants. All right, let's continue. <laughs> <laughs> he swings his lightsaber around. He could have sliced her in two because the Padawan doesn't do anything to the flag. Instead, yep. Smiler intentionally aims for the lightsaber, and he could have just killed her so easily then. Oh my gosh, this fight scene is dog crap. Come <laughs> on. And people might say, oh, you should judge a fight scene on how fast and flashy it is and stuff. And you get engaged. No, 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 no. Because you can have fast and flashy and make something that isn't retarded. Okay? Yeah. We've seen fast Keep and flashy. Keep in mind what he just said right there. Mostly. Mm -hmm. Keep in mind what he just said. You can have flashy and you can have all that stuff. You just, you, But you can also have it not be retarded. Keep that. Keep that in mind. He's absolutely right about that. Keep mm -hmm. that. Legitimate stuff, like legitimate moves that just draw you in and it really engages you. Obi-Wan versus Anakin. I've done the autopsy on it. Check it out. This does not hold a candle to but it was uh, than this. Yeah. The, um, uh, the prequel lightsaber fighting. Not at all. This is some of the worst we've seen, par for the course for Disney Star Wars. The only difference that they've changed, right, in terms of this, what we see here, versus what Disney Star Wars has seen others, it's a bit faster. The movements are just as crap. It just says, oh, I'll aim for the person who's not even there. I'll aim for air. I'll try and hit your lightsaber. I'll kick you and I could have killed you. <laughs> I, I, or you're at my mercy and I'll just move. Like This is full of such crap. It's baffling that people are praising it so much. <laughs> oh, they did it again. They did it again. And this is like a crucial point, right? See, see where she is at. She's right, right. Yeah, knowing that, like the head is the helmet is like a place where okay, your sword won't work. Like, why would you still go for it? Or you can even just go a little lower. Yeah, you could, right. you, could you could decapitate him. Yep, go a little lower. Yeah, she yeah, should have hired Star Wars kid. Yeah, Star Wars kid Maybe. choreography would have been top tier. Oh, oh, oh wait, <laughs> I forgot. There's a Cortosis shirt. <laughs> oh yeah, that's true. Yeah. Oh man. Right here. Okay. Okay. Instead of like striking with a lightsaber, like there, right? She Neck. decides to elbow him when he's open. He's just going to kill him. Just strike right there. If you can so hit him with your elbow, cool you can hit him with your lightsaber. <laughs> but anyway, just kill him. <laughs> but no, no. Instead, ah, oh, this is such. Oh, crap. that's. So, oh, okay, yeah, so, yeah, he even had one that. more. He even had one more chance. Yeah, she knocks, she knocks. Okay, so it's, I, I guess the reason why they wanted to do this is because the whole face reveal. Oh, no. It's it's uh, uh, Manny Jacinto. It's, uh, it's a better version of Ezra Miller. Oh, no. That's the big reveal because the helmet falls off. But the thing is that she dies immediately after this because he knocks also the helmet noticed, off. And Yeah, go ahead. When she elbows him in the head, which is actually a legit move, uh, and what, look what happens to his head. His face... Reaches the sky and guess what's exposed? His neck. It's a I was great like his, move. I was you, like his you, penis. You, <laughs> yeah. No. You <laughs> knock him in the head. He, his head pops back and now his neck is exposed and you cut his head yeah. off. Yep. Great move. But she never um, followed up. Yep. I said twice. Uh, that whole time she could have just sliced his head off or sliced him in half because if uh, if he hits the helmet, it might turn off. Yeah, aim it a little lower, right? And just hit him. That whole time you could have just gone slash. <laughs> yeah this is what this is part where shad dies yeah <laughs> he's like i'm done i'm done that's basically you know his like his he, he basically became flaccid right there but yeah thanks for checking out this segment of the project egg row podcast if you like what we do here please like share subscribe hit the notification bell and you will know next time when we go live we do go live every saturday at 8 p.m 
Once again, we are just getting started. Tons of more video to come. Thanks, and we'll see you guys next time.